Hey guys, it's your girl Seller707 and I was thinking as I was making my last two videos about my eyeshadows that I just love and I was thinking I haven't done a favorites video in a while so I'm going to come to you today with a few of my favorites. Well, let's start out. Remember we were going to Rite Aid and we were getting all of those incense and stuff? Well, I found, I picked up a few of the scented sandalwood. Um incense and I have been burning these to no end these are really good smelling they, they're really like simple and they're fresh and they don't have a lot of that overpowering fragrance to it so um next time I go to Rite Aid I'm gonna go and pick up some more of these sandalwood ones and you get um 25 um incense stick in this pack and that was when we were doing the floral scents um, haul when these were like really really cheap and you could get like I think it was a three dollar up reward so that's one of my favorites I love 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 and the flavor of this one is well I should say the scent of this one is sandalwood and then as you can see on my nails I've been loving this Revlon and this one's called Raven's Red 721 so I have been loving this because I always like the Revlon um, nail polishes because they seem to stay on for a long time. I did, I've had this on for like a couple of days now. Look, except for that one. I chipped that one doing some, but look at the color of that one. Isn't that a pretty color? It's just so gorgeous. And the lip gloss that I have been loving forever, because you can see I don't wore this one to death. And there's hardly any of it left in there. Um, is the um, Physician um, Formulas lip gloss. It's when I got this lip gloss, I thought it was just going to be just a regular, you know, lip gloss that I could put on top of my lipstick. But I was amazed and shocked that when I put this on, it's like a mood lipstick. You put this on and it changes to the color of um, of your your body, the chemistry of your body. You know the mine when I put it on it turns to a really beautiful um, burgundy color and the cool thing is, is that it lights up see how it lights up and I thought that was just the added bonus of this lipstick that it lights up so sometime when I'm in my car or I'm going to my car and I need to find my keys this is a perfect little thing that I cut on and it has a beautiful mirror with it so I'm loving these so if you ever have an opportunity to um try this physician formula it's a lip gloss and it comes in just the way it's looking now it has a, a pink um container black top and then the button on the top is where you push for the light to come on isn't that pretty cool i thought it was it was i thought this was pretty sneaky okay and then the next thing i found out is cvs that i have been loving is these nail polish pad removers because inside here instead of doing like the liquid and stuff they're individual wrapped pads that and I only have to use one of these when I need to take all my nail polish off just one of these does the trick and I put these in my purse or they're just so handy because once I finish using the little um, cloth that's in here I put it back in the container and then I just throw it away and these um See, it says one pad cleans all 20 nails. I'm thinking 20 nails. They <laughs> sure? Well, I've never had to do two hands of nails. So, but um, it does for just your two hands. They do it perfectly. And, you know, I'm always talking about this all May um, eye makeup remover pads. Because, you know, I'm always going to Walmart. And I'm always using these as overage, but um, I love these. These take off your eye makeup really quick and simple, and they're lightweight. So I just throw these in my purse, and off I go. And these are my All May um, eye makeup removers. And let's talk about a blast from the past. Gina Tay. Now, you know I'm dating myself, right? Because I love Gina Tay. I was wearing this stuff when I was in high school. I first discovered it when you know when you're when I have three older sisters and they used to spritz themselves after they got out of the bath and I used to always say what is that and you know how you wait till they leave and then you go in there and you test out all their products and stuff so I went in there and I was spraying myself down it was funny stories that my sister came in and she caught me 
and it happened to be some of her stuff boy oh boy she was letting me have it she kept saying i'm gonna go tell dad so i was like don't tell don't tell i won't ever do it again but you know what that wasn't the truth because as soon as a couple of days blew over what was i doing right back in there spraying this stuff again and putting my lotion on so if you have never tried Gina Day and you're um, after splash girl that likes to spritz yourself like I do when I get out of the out of the tub or the shower, this stuff is some good stuff right here. And then for a sweet little treat, I love these nips. Never knew anything about these nips until we had that. You know, you purchase these from CVS and then you got your money back in the ECB. So I tried the caramel was the first one I tried and I loved it. So I still have a few more and they're only 30 calories um, per piece. And they come in these little individual wraps. Well, let me show you what they look like. Just pour them out. See they're individually wrapped little caramels. Which are good and 30 calories. So I like to suck on these when I just need a little something sweet in the middle or the end or the beginning of the day. And then they also had this one, which is the peanut butter um, parfait. These are really good too. So the one that I really want to try is the eggnog. So if you haven't tried the eggnog, go ahead and try that. Alright guys, I just wanted to come to you with a few of my favorites. And I will talk to you again soon. Alright guys, take care. Bye bye.